So cloud computing. Uh, I remember us talking about cloud computing in the beginning of 2013, and there was a lot of interest around this. It was still um, sort of talked about as uh, one of those concepts that's there. What we've seen in 2014 is cloud has really taken hold. Um, so some of our, our clients have started experimenting with cloud, doing proofs of concepts, uh, doing some private cloud solutions, and then of course as consumers, I think cloud has become mainstream. And I think that's an interesting trend or sub-trend if you like, where there's been a consumer push to a lot of these technologies. This ties into some work that KPMG has done uh, globally, uh, a series of articles we've done called Consumers and Con Convergence. It's the push from consumers needing to, uh, because of the accessibility of devices and the devices that they use and the technology that we now all carry and wear, being able to access the information that they need on the go. And cloud has facilitated a lot of that. So what I'm, what I'm seeing is as cloud computing has taken hold in the consumer's mind and in the employee's mind and in the director's mind, the questions are being asked, well, how can we use this in our organization? And CIOs that we talk to are also saying, well, instead of having this massive infrastructure that I need to look after, what can I take and put into a secure cloud? We use secure on purpose because it's not just about putting it on a cloud somewhere um, on the planet. It's about how do I know where the data is, how can I get my data out if I need it, and how secure is my data. But having said all that, I see cloud really gaining more traction. Um, it's here to stay. It's now a question of how much of my organization's IT can I put into a cloud and then focus on my core business.